Baby, don't check for me. Taking time out to be and live my life off screen. Taking time out. To hey guys, it's Sharika, and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. So on today's vlog, um, we did a shot with me. I did the DIY grass wall and then I finally get to show you guys my patio. I actually started vlogging most of today's vlog yesterday, but I forgot to do an intro. So I went to Bears Furniture just to look for like some new decor pieces. They have some really cool stuff in there, but they're very, very expensive. So I took you guys around in there. It was my first time going there. It's directly across from Ikea if you guys are here in Jacksonville. It's a really, really nice store. So y'all should check it out. Um, and then when I came home, I started on the grass wall. I showed you guys a little bit of that.
Okay, so now that I have that done and everything is zip tied together, what I'm gonna use is, this is a clothing rack and I'm gonna wait for my husband to get um, some additional bars to extend it a little bit more so um, I don't know like where to order that from, but my husband, he knows all about that type of stuff. So he'll know exactly, you know, where I can uh, order an extension for those bars so they can be a little higher, but it's going to zip tie it to the bars and then I'll be done. So you could use a backdrop, you could use the clothing rack, you could use, you know, whatever you want to use. Some people use plywood. I would prefer to use the plywood because I like that whole hedge look. It looks really expensive and then it has like the wood at the bottom. I love the way that that look, but I don't have the materials to do that type of stuff. And if you were to buy it in store, it's really expensive. So that's the one that I would prefer, but I'm gonna do mine like this and it should work just fine. So, all right y'all, and here is my wall. The reason that I like to use the clothing rack is because that way I can move it around. If I want to make it wider, I can do that. Um, I do plan on getting a black sheet to put behind it so that way you can't see through it. Um, but yeah, this is it. And this is something that will pretty much last you forever if you do it the right way. So. I really like the way that it turned out. I'm so happy. So happy with it. And I also bought some of these from Ikea. I only started with two boxes just to make sure that I like the way that it looked. So now is the big reveal to my balcony. I love it out there. It turned out so nice. I actually filmed this portion of the video last night. So you guys will notice that the cushions are not on my chairs um, because I take them off at night and I did add a clip this morning with the cushions on so you guys will be able to see you know how the chairs look with the cushions on I get a lot of questions about those chairs I did link them on my Amazon account down below last I heard they were sold out So here's how the chairs look with the cushions on. So y'all now I'm just sitting on my balcony, having a cup of coffee. I love it out here. So beautiful. So I just got home, my son wanted some donuts. So we told the lady to just surprise us, but mostly glazed. So we got three glazed donuts, chocolate, sprinkles, and then this is supposed to be a powdered jelly donut. 
But where's the powder? Like, girl. And then Kalila got a coffee. What is this, Kalila? I don't drink that because I drink Nespresso. <laughs> Y'all, it's so hot outside right now. But um, I love my Nespresso machine. I've been like making coffee like all day because I really like it. I got 12 free pots with the Nespresso machine and look how many I have left. <laughs> Cause I've just been like, I've been trying to get everybody to drink coffee just so I can use the Nespresso machine. I offered you a coffee earlier. You like, no, I don't want a coffee. But then you gonna get one from Dunkin Donuts. That's real fake. <laughs> See how that is? We're gonna um, probably cook some little stuff today. Oh, there's Tony. We're gonna cook some stuff today. Ryan's coming over later on and we'll be out here. I know a lot of people are probably wondering why I take my cushions off of the chairs and it's because I sit them right next to the planters and I don't want a lot of dirt to go on the chairs. I ordered some Scotch Guard for outdoors and that's supposed to protect it from the sun and the rain and dirt and all that stuff. Oh. So look at your dad. Hi, honey. Mother? Hi, honey. When I see it, I know you're a star. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, y'all, so my brother's here, so we're getting ready to go to the store, grab a few things for some cocktails, and then we're gonna try to recreate um, the Louisiana fondue from Harry's, my favorite restaurant, period. Um, we're gonna try to recreate that meal where well, my brother's gonna do it. I'm just gonna watch and taste test it. So um, I'm gonna try to vlog while we're in Walmart. I can't just like, vlog in public hey, why not? it's just i don't know because i don't like the stairs and you know how i am like i don't like people staring at me on a regular day so just imagine when you have this camera out and they staring at you i don't, I don't like it i just don't yeah I love it. you love it because mm -hmm. as soon as i put the um, camera down they be like are you a youtuber yes i am don't forget to watch and subscribe No, I got it all fit. It's all on camera. Who are you? <laughs> We're in Walmart. I don't feel that bad because I got my gang with me. <laughs> Y'all know I am not a public vlogger like at all. Okay, what ingredients are we getting? Green, uh, garlic. You ain't got garlic at the house? Yeah, I got garlic. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so cream, garlic, white cheddar, yellow cheddar, and um, tomato paste or tomato sauce. Okay. Where he at? Okay, y'all. So Ryan's gonna make. Where is he? So Ryan makes this really good. He's not over here. He done left us in the store. So Ryan makes this really good um, sangria. And he's gonna make us some today. I'm gonna try to get him to tell y'all the recipe, but it's so good. Do you have the? If you like sweet. Burning up. <laughs> Ryan walking so slow, like, I have to upload this vlog tonight and Ryan's walking like, he don't got nothing to do. Girl, I'm sorry. You got that right. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, we did it. We, we vlogged did it, in Joe. the store. We did it. We did it, Joe. All right, you guys, so the ingredients is very simple. So you start off with some lemonade daiquiri mix, frozen. Mm-hmm. Some Malabute coconut rum. They got the Hennessy. <laughs> I prefer getting the Arbor Mist to strawberry mango, but they didn't have it, so we're just gonna do the rose sangria. 
and top it off with some tonic water because it's going to be super duper sweet and then you drop some fruit in there so watch me work Don't